Hi guys, welcome to today's video. Today we're going to be tying the most creature pattern. For this I'm going to be using a standard dry fly hook in size 12. I also have some grizzly hackle. And for my body I'm going to be using some grizzly hackle quill. And I also have some black thread. So to begin, I'm going to wrap my thread starting about three quarters away on my hook and wrap back all the way to the bend of the hook. Once I get to the bend of the hook, I'm going to grab my grizzly half hole and I'm going to take take out a few fibers to form my tail. I'm just going to rip them off. I'm going to measure out my fibers, my grizzly hackle fibers, to measure the same length as my hook shank. And I'm going to transfer this measurement and then secure my fibers in place. You can come in with your scissors and cut out the extra, the excess fibers. And run your thread to make a smooth body. So then run my thread back to that point. At this point I shall grab the same hack oil feather and I shall take out all the fibers. What I want is the is the quill exposed. This will form my body. Once I have a nice length, I shall cut out the ends that I don't need. And I shall come in and secure and secure my hack hole quill in place. I shall then take close touching wraps using my hack hole quill. And once I get to the end, I shall take a few thread wraps and I shall then come in with my scissors and cut out the excess. Once my quill is in position, I shall grab two hackle tips and place them back to back forming a V-shape. I shall then hold them to measure my hook shank, making sure that they same, they're the same length as my hook shank. I shall then come in and grab those and tie my hackle tips in place. Come in with my scissors and cut out the excess. I'll then come in with my thread and run it making sure that my hackle tips stand at a 90, 90 degree angle.
can come in with your scissors and do a bit of a cleanup. And position back your hackle tips. Once I'm done, I shall grab my hackle feather. Expose the base of the quill and secure this in place. I'll then wrap this around to form my wing. I shall take very close wraps. Make sure your tips maintain their upright position. Once you get to the eye of the hook, you can wrap your thread and finish up your fly. Shall do a whip finish. And come in with my scissors and cut out my thread and also cut out the extra hackle fiber. Once I'm done, I shall take my fly out of my vise. I shall use my scissors to cut out any hackle fibers that are, out, that are out of place. Just to make sure my fly looks tidy. And there we have it guys, that's the mosquito pattern in size 12. I hope you enjoyed the video. And if you did, please leave a like below, leave a comment. And I'll see you in the next video. Thank you for watching.